hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is sterling um today's video is just gonna be like a little q a video just because i haven't really done anything on the channel like that and i want you guys to be able to get to know me a little better so um i have about like 20 to 25 questions that i just came up with that are like good starter icebreaker questions um so yeah Question number one is, when is my birthday? My birthday is June 1st, and then that leads me into my next question, which is question number two. What is my zodiac sign? Um, my zodiac sign is a Gemini, and I know, I know. Before you say anything bad, I promise I'm a good person, and I promise it, it really doesn't make a difference. Gemini, the rest of them, like, it is what it is. Uh, question number three is, what is my age? um i'm 21 years old yeah it's a different life but it's it's just a lot more fun it is it's worth the wait but also it's not anything to be rushing to like do like it's really not question four is what is my favorite color so i'm really into like beige black gray like i'm very neutral like i wouldn't say if I had to pick like a color color, I would probably say yellow is my favorite color, but like I'm really, really into like neutrals and stuff like that. Most of my clothing is black, gray, beige, white. Like I don't really wear a lot of colors just because, I don't know, I just don't. Yellow does look good on me, orange looks good on me, but I just, I don't really, I don't really wear them much, so. The next question is, am I in school? So yeah, I am in college. This is my senior year coming up. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I'm excited for it. Um, we get to live in our own little place this year. So I'm super excited for like decoration and stuff like that. So yeah, um, the next question is, do I play sports? Um, yeah, I play softball. Um, I've been playing softball literally my whole life and it's paying for my school. So it was probably one of the best decisions I could have made because I am debt free right now. So yeah, I have played softball since I was seven years old. The next question is what year am I? I already answered that, but um, I'm a rising senior. The next question is what am I studying? Um, I'm studying kinesiology and I'm on the pre-PA track. So after this, I'm gonna graduate and apply to PA school and try to go to PA school. So yeah. Um, the next question is what is my favorite fast food? My favorite fast food, okay. This is the debacle. My favorite fast food was Chipotle until today, literally. I don't know what it is about Chipotle right now, but like nothing tastes good. Like every single time I order, it's super bland, like super bland. Like the rice don't be cilantro liming no more. The corn salsa don't be jalapenoing no more. And the chicken don't be like biting back. Like it's not even like salty or nothing. Like I don't understand it. Like I really don't understand it. So. I would say right now it's probably Wendy's because that five dollar biggie bag be busting every single time, or Chick Fil A because Chick Fil A be making my stomach hurt, but it does bust every single time. I'm not gonna lie, every time. The next question is, what is my dream vacation? Um, honestly, anywhere on an island. Like you can take me and put me anywhere on an island, and I'm gonna be happy. But if I had to choose, I'd probably say like, um. If I could choose, it would probably be like Greece or something, but that's so cliche. Like, I know that sounds so cliche, but like, I really do want to go to Greece. I feel like it's just super pretty, but I don't want to go to parts that like everywhere go, everyone goes to. I kind of want to just like find somewhere a little different. I love food, so like, I really want to like taste the food there. Like, honestly, like, that would be my dream vacation is just to go everywhere and try food. Like, literally try food, be on an island. Like, that's my thing. Um, what has been my favorite vacation that I've taken? Um, me and my best friend this past summer went on our, I went on my first cruise. She goes on cruises all the time, but I went on my first cruise and it was so much fun. We went on a, it was a um, MSC cruise line, which was kind of like a foreign cruise line. It was like, um, it was nice, but 
if I when we do go again because me and my family are going on a cruise I think we're going on carnival so I feel like that'll be a little more fun but it was a good like it was a good experience I liked it the next question is what inspired me to start a YouTube I'm not gonna lie like literally since I'm a kid like I've always taken vlogs like I literally have stuff from like two or three years ago that I've just like take with my family on vacation or like my parents my dad's big into social media like he does cooking and stuff like that so I don't know we're just like a very social media family and I've always like taken vlogs or like just like wanted to like show my life just because I mean it's not that exciting but like I think it'd be fun to have like people that kind of support me from a different you know like people I don't know like I feel like it would be nice for them to just be like interested in my life or like support me or just like you know interested in what I'm doing also just creating content and like giving me ideas of what like you guys want to see and stuff like that so it just inspired me um why not I do it now um because why not you know I've always done it and I've, it's always been something that I kind of wanted to do but I just never like actually did it so I was just like you know what this summer I'm just gonna like sit down I'm gonna like I'm not gonna be doing much it's my last summer to kind of relax so I just wanted to know kind of get content together and just put it out there for people to see favorite album male and female so right now my favorite album that i can play over and over again by a female would either be mahalia's new album i think it's irl or kiana Lede's new album which i haven't listened to fully but every single time i play it, i'm like oh it just gets better and better but mahalia definitely like that album is so good so good and i've been following her since she like um went on tour with LMA like the first time and she was like her opener and I was like ooh, kind of like her and I, I'd been listening to her like a little bit but like when I saw her in person I was like yeah and then she came out with an EP and I was like yes and then she just came out with this album and I was like absolutely so yeah male I would say Gunna's new album is probably like on repeat for me it's just super good every single song is really good so yeah and my the next question is am I a sweet or salty person I love sweets like I feel like every time I eat something I'm like dang I gotta have something sweet I gotta have something sweet like I'm a brownie girl but I don't like chocolate don't we'll get into that another time <laughs> um I like cookies but they're like mm, like I like snickerdoodle and chocolate chip again weird I know I just said I don't like chocolate but I have a bit okay when I was a kid I had low tooth enamel so I couldn't eat like sweets or like uh, I had to like stay away from sugar and chocolate was one of like the main things that they told me not to eat um everything i ate had to be sugar free so whenever i ate it again it just was like not busting like that so i just don't eat it but i wouldn't say I, mm, I don't like it i like maybe a twix that's probably the only thing that i can really eat or do like but yeah um i would say i'm a sweet person can i cook is the next question yes i can cook my whole family can pretty much cook my sister can cook i can cook my dad can cook my dad grills a lot but um yeah i can cook um i'll try to insert a few things that i've cooked um recently i cooked like mussels and like this little like lemon garlic sauce and it was actually really good um so yeah like honestly cooking is something that i always is just like if you know how to follow a recipe or like look online and look at what you want to make like honestly you can make it like it's really not that complicated i feel like um that's really how i taught myself is just by experience and like learning and now i don't have like the best knife skills i'm not i didn't go to like culinary school like i don't look like that but if you give me a recipe and tell me to do it like i can probably do it so yeah the next question is do i have any nicknames yes so like growing up playing a sport obviously like a lot of people are going to call you a lot of different things so like i would say my sport nickname is ling everybody calls me ling or ling ling whatever or stir which i don't know i don't really know how i feel about that one because it's just like i've always been at home they call me sterl or sterling or my sister be calling me all kinds of stuff she'd be calling me squirrel stuff like that so stir is just a little weird to me because it's like my name is Sterling, and you gonna chop off the L? Like, just say Stero. Like, Stir is crazy. But question is, do I have any phobias? Yeah, um, I don't really like stickers. Like, I just, as a kid, I've never really liked, growing up, like, I never really liked stickers. I didn't like them. I just don't like, like, the stickiness of them. Like, I can do tape, but barely. And, like, I don't know. I just really don't like stickers, like, at all. Like, they just don't amuse me. Like, 
it's really like when you put them on something and you take it off like when it leaves like the little residue or like you take it off and it like gets like that like uh dust and stuff collects on it like i can't do that like it's disgusting to me and then another phobia i low-key have is michael jackson i'm not gonna commit it like it's not even a phobia it's just like i don't like thinking about him at night he just like his face it's not even his music or nothing it's just like his face genuinely scares me so yeah like thinking about it right now is kind of making my heart race um do i have any piercings so i have like one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 13 dang yeah i have 13 piercings um how did i really get into it like um my cartilage this was the first one that i got wait where is it at no these were the first two that i got and i got them at the same time at myrtle beach like literally got them at myrtle beach was the dumbest thing i could have done and we played the next day softball and i had to put my helmet on and it was literally like throbbing but they took a long time to heal these are probably the worst piercings that i did get um my septum i got when i turned 18 because i was tired of everybody telling me i couldn't do it and i was like you know what i'm just gonna get it my mom took me to get my nose pierced both my holes bottom two holes my mom took me to get pierced i got my rook in college um my friend was getting actually i think I, we just wanted like piercings and i just got it in the middle of the season this one was literally like the worst healing process ever but it's super cute now um but yeah this one was super super painful like for a long time my conch i got last year probably last year and literally it did not hurt like at all like you would think like going through the back of your ear like no she did it and i was like are you done she was like yeah but i also have like a high pain tolerance or piercings so yeah um and then this one was like just really spontaneous i really don't even know why i got it but i just got it um what did i eat last um my dad made some jerk chicken jerk chicken wings so i just ate some jerk chicken wings um i only had two because they were kind of spicy and like i like spicy food but like sometimes too much like enough is enough so i had to cut it out and then the last question is gonna be what is my current obsession my current obsession right now is <laughs> excuse me my current obsession right now is probably love island um i'm watching a lot of shows right now and i don't know really how i'm gonna maintain it but love island right now is my current obsession because i just went to my best one of my best friend's houses and we were like we're just gonna start it and we literally watched like 12 episodes over like two days so it's good i like for some reason like love the concept but i love reality tv like on my bucket list is to go on a reality tv show like i literally love reality tv so much i think that is so entertaining for like no reason i love the drama i love it like i just love it so yeah also another question i guess i can answer is like what shows am i watching right now um love island i'm watching elite which is like a hispanic show it's kind of like how to get away with murder and but it's not like how to get away with murder like the way that it's filmed like it always starts with like a crime scene and then it goes back and kind of tells like the backstory about how like it happened um yellowstone which i restarted because my dad was like how could you stop this like you're literally at the best part so i restarted yellowstone i'm on like season three elite i'm on season four um and then I'm watching Spongebob because when I was growing up, I was not allowed to watch Spongebob and growing up, everybody would be like making all these Spongebob jokes and all this stuff. And you know who wouldn't get it? Me. So now I'm making it my life mission to understand every single last joke that anyone has ever said to me. So I watch Spongebob when I go to sleep um because like i always have like a night show it used to be amazing world of gumball but i finished it and it was so sad because when i tell you i love that show too like i'm a big cartoon person like adult cartoons entertain me a lot like i just really like them um so yeah well thank you for watching um 
thank you for getting to know a little bit more about me i hope that you guys like this video and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and be on the lookout for my next video um it'll probably be a vlog we're heading to on vacation soon so be looking forward to that and i'll see you guys next time Thank you.